Big Kirk 916. Positivity motivation. Never settle for average, man. Shout out to the brand for letting me represent. And um, you guys shouldn't settle for average either. Pick up a hat. Anyways, you know, I was just finishing a workout in the gym and I saw the post of uh, Rhode Island State Senator Tierra Mack. She was um, doing a handstand at the beach in a bikini twerking, um, basically addressing her constituents, saying that they should reelect her for a state senate and that uh, she's uh, the voice of the people. Now, whatever you do in your private time is one thing. You know, you can do whatever freakery you want to do in the bedroom, you know, whatever you got going on as far as uh, your orientation is your business. But when you talk about somebody that's seeking the approval of the community or the state or whatever county, do you think that's appropriate? And from what I understand, you know, she um, she identifies with the LGBTQ community, which is fine. But some of the things that she is pushing in regards to her policies is leaning towards things that children should not be privy to. But she feels that it's appropriate. And I feel that it's totally dehumanizing, demeaning for you to think that your twerking is your, your, your constituents that want a representative that carries himself like that. It would be like saying the president comes in there sagging. What up, my nigga? You know, he's representing um, the niggas in the hood. Come on, man. There's a time and a place for everything. And that's not professional at all. You, 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 is that the, is that how you perceive that young black women want to be represented? Young black men, they want their girls twerking and everything. I mean, is that just what we've been reduced to? Just 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 uh, 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 twerking, um, street niggas, um, strippers, you know, this is everything. I mean, come on, man. If you're doing, like I said, private life is cool. Twerk all you want for your girl at home, you know. Twerk all you want, do your thing, whatever you want to do in the bedroom, freakery, you know, uh, do it all. But when you talk about young women, is that the, is that what you want to portray? Is that what you're looking to attract and say that this is endorsed? You want kids to be up there tossing dollars out, little girls. Do you, do you think that's appropriate? And you're the face of the black community, or maybe you're not the face of the black community. Let it be known. But you're the face of not even just the black community, but the white community, too, because you're asking for their votes likewise. Because not only black people are going to vote for you, right? It's going to be white, Asian, Hispanic. And that's what you want. That's what you think is cool. Man, you, you you are the epitome of what's going on with the black culture as far as the direction you, you want to be represented and looked upon. And for you to do that and then turn around and say you want respect. Come on, man. You, you're not you're not even you're not even carrying yourself in a high valued, respectable manner doing that. I did some things, but I'm not going to come up there and say, hey, vote for me and start grabbing myself and dancing around and doing come because I'm that's not what that plat platform is for that's not a platform you do that with it's just like these people taking kids and having them get on stage with these why are you doing that why are you doing that man that's not for kids and that's not for the political audience you're, you're supposed to be looking out for one the community and their values um 
how to improve living conditions and making sure education and things are taken care of on a state level. Not twerking and shaking your ass, talking about, yeah, you're consistent with your post and blah, blah, blah. And I mean, why would you open? What are you doing? What are you doing, man? That's the problem right now. And nobody says nothing. There's not one I've seen major outside of Judge Joe Brown saying anything. There's some people on here and there, but there's nobody major in entertainment saying, man, that's out of pocket. Ain't nobody saying nothing. Everybody quiet, quiet as a church mouth. But soon as something else happens, oh my God, that's racist. Oh my God, why'd they do this? But ain't nobody saying nothing about this shit. That's straight garbage, man. Straight garbage. Tierra Max shaking her ass doing that. Why? Come on, man. I'm, it's embarrassing, man. And you wonder why people, they always look and say, oh, you know, they got to give you uh, uh, a second look to try to figure out what kind of time you're on when they see shit like that and you're a state senator. I'm an ex-fell and I can carry myself in more dignified manner on a public platform than that shit. I should be up in the state running for office. If you're going to carry it like that, you need to get up out of here, man. You're not, you're not, you're nothing I can see long term that's good for anything. And if you get into a higher position, you ain't gonna be nothing but trash, man. I'm sorry. I'm keeping it 100. It's just an embarrassing man. I, I, that's, that's the last thing I would expect from somebody in a political position to be doing some shit like that, man. I, I, that's just, you guys tell me what you think as far as if you want somebody representing your state pushing that type of behavior and agenda for your daughter, for your son, for the community in the whole. Big Herc 916. This video is brought to you by Amato Enterprise, the best in TV mounting in the Phoenix, Arizona area. They build TV walls over the fireplace, ceiling mounts, all for as low as $100. Rated number one in the Phoenix, Arizona area on thumbtack.com for your TV mounting needs in Arizona, contact Amato Enterprise. Don't forget to stop by the Big Herc 916 store and pick up a sticker for your car or a patch or a sticker for your laptop or maybe a beanie or read one of the many books that Big Herc 916 has authored. You know how we do it. Hello. I'm Big Herc 916. Contact me for life coaching and motivational speaking.